welcome to Border Bananas. My name is Jamie. Today we are going thrifting at two separate Goodwills. Josie and I made a day of it. We had a lot of fun. I've got a table full of stuff here to show you when we are done. So let's go thrifting and then come back and enjoy the haul. So this Goodwill is still 50% off. Their decor, but they are still bringing it out. So that's kind of cool. All kinds of like old containers in here. Some polka chips. Oh, you scared me. And <laughs> Josie just came in and popped in above me. I think I just found a timber pot. I did find a chamber pot. $6.99 and it is no way spode. What do you think? It's pretty, but it's very we got paint or something on it by the looks. I don't know. I'll put it in the cart just in case. Some kind of art out here. All kinds of art in here. Some cows. Somebody made a tied blanket here, quilt style. That blanket's still here. There's kitties. <laughs> Some very simple quilting. $1.99. Oh, that's for the sham. I wonder if Josie would like that. I don't know. I'll tell her about it and have her come look at it. Ooh, that looks soft. That is definitely soft. <laughs> That's kind of neat. I have a messenger bag there. It's from Target for $4.99. Kind of neat. This guy's really cool. $4.99. It's really light though. I don't know what this is. Can you guys read it? Am I looking at it upside down? Hmm. I don't know, but it's cool. It looks like a lily pad. <clears throat> okay, so that's a straight up legit painting for $14.99. Mm. That's pretty cool. Oh, there's the name right there. That's pretty cool. I don't love the frame on this thing, though. There's one of those race hangers. That's pretty cool. It's very wobbly. That would blow over on my front porch really quickly. It's really cool. I love a good... Oh my gosh, it's so heavy. Architecture picture. $10.99. I am looking through the stamps because Josie got a button maker for Christmas and she has been loving making buttons and I thought it would be fun if she could, you know, stamp some and sell some even. Ooh, that's a cool laminated map. That's pretty cool. I wonder how much that is. $4.99. That's nice. Um, 
Exterminator. What is that? <laughs> Who knows? basket never seen one like that before eight nine no six ninety nine that's kind of cool that one would make a cool cat bed <laughs> love this little guy. He is adorable. $1.90 or $3.99. Cute. That's pretty amazing. $8.99. Check it out. Japan. Unfortunately, Goodwill is playing some music. It's good music, but it's loud music and it's coming through my video. So I have to um, do a little bit of a musical overlay.
Oh, somebody painted it. <laughs> so sad. Oh, it's very broken. Good baskets. Four ninety nine for this guy. That one's cool too. Somebody glued something into the bottom of it though. <laughs> the colors of this but I don't like the, the heart wreath but if you turn it around it looks like that isn't that pretty I completely forgot to haul this table, but this table did come home with me. It was 
uh, $7.99, I believe, and it did have a stamp on the bottom that said Made in England. It's perfectly sturdy. I was so excited to find it. Oh my goodness, you guys. I found some good stuff today. Christmas was only 50% off still, which I think is kind of weird because <laughs> most people have their Christmas gone now, but um, I did find a couple of items. They are still bringing out their Christmas. And I'm going to show you those items first. There's three items. They're all the same. And they're very similar to something that I've already hauled for you guys. But they are the Gorum um, Silver Ornaments. And they're a box of three. I'm going to take the cover off so you can see them without the glare. This is the cover. All three of them are brand new in box. Never been used. Still have the little things behind them. The little hangers. And they are the Angels with Hearts. I love these things so much. They are so beautiful. And they had three boxes of them. So all three of them, they were each $2.50 each. So I was really excited about that. And I will have a link, or I'm sorry, yeah, a link down below of the product I use to polish up my silver i use it on the sponge side there's a it's a double-sided applicator i use it on the sponge side and it cleans off the tarnish it's like it just melts off you just wipe it on and rinse it away it is amazing i've never i just by fluke tried it and oh my goodness it was amazing so i purchased all three of these i'm not sure exactly what i'm going to do with them yet like I said last, in my last video, they would make such a beautiful garland. Wouldn't they make a beautiful garland? Um, so, um, yeah, I grabbed all three of those. This one isn't, yeah, there we go. So, yeah, all three. So exciting. And then I did buy one, hold on, okay, one craft item, and it's this peaches and cream white yarn. Um, I love this stuff. I am making um, some dishcloths out of it, some crochet dishcloths. Oh, by the way, um, everything that wasn't Christmas was 25% off because we, I used our veterans discount. Um, so this I paid $1.50 for, which is a good price for some peaches and cream. And it looks like, I don't know, it might have been used a little bit. Somebody had taped it here to find the edge, but um, there's a lot left on here. So I grabbed that. And then I also found, oh, I found two craft items. I picked these up too. It is a whole, well, there's a shell in here too. <laughs> a whole bag of metal bobbins, which I was excited about because bobbins, metal bobbins are a little pricier these days if you can find them. So they were $2.99, so I paid $2.25 for them after my discount. So um, I love finding stuff like this at the thrift store because you can always use more bobbins, right? <laughs> And then I found one item for me. I don't know if any of you know this about me, but I love houndstooth. <laughs> I just adore it. And I found these pants. They were $6.99, so I did get 25% off that. What does that work out to be? Like $5.25, maybe $4.75, something like that. And um, they're just these houndstooth ankle pants. Oh, I am so excited to try these on. Maybe I'll try them on for the... Yeah, I'll try them on for this video for you guys. I think they are so cute. I cannot wait. I hope they fit because Goodwills in my area do not have try-on rooms anymore, so it's kind of a crapshoot whether or not they're going to fit. And I'm a curvy girl. I need curvy pants, um, so if they fit me in the, the waist, they usually don't fit me in the hips, and if they fit me in the, hi in the hips, then they just fall off. So... <laughs> um, um, I'm excited to try those on. Hopefully they fit. Then I found another piece of ironstone. However, it is mismatched. Um, it was $3.99, so I paid $3 for it, and it looks like this. I have no idea what this is. None whatsoever. This top here does not fit. It is not ironstone. I think it's probably porcelain or something. Maybe it's ironstone. I don't think so, though. But this is ironstone um and i oh look it's double tagged somebody just put it together <laughs> i wonder which one they use yellow or green i don't know um 
it was taped together when I bought it. I took the tape off so I could look inside and it is really dirty and you can see that it is most definitely ironstone unless the mark is underneath on the bottom, um, it is unmarked and this is super heavy, but I don't know what this is. Do you guys know what it is? And it looks like it would almost perfectly fit a roll of toilet paper, <laughs> but um, yeah, so I don't know what it is. But I love it and I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but I'm sure I can use it for something. I snatched that up. And then out of randomness, just because I liked the color of the glass and the size of it, I grabbed one of these. They had two of these giant bottles. I don't know if you can tell. Yeah, you can. But that is that cool green grass, or grass, <laughs> glass, and I think it must have been like a liquor bottle or something like that. Cause isn't wine bottles they usually have that indent like that, right? Um, it has a V and an O on the bottom and some letters that I can't read. But it says Big 360 on there. So is that a liquor, you guys? I have no idea. Um, I'm not a big drinker. I do enjoy an adult beverage once in a while, but I am not a big drinker. This was $3.99, so I paid $3 for it. If I have an Ikea bottle that is probably a third of the size of this um, that I use for vinegar in my laundry room. I may switch it out, but I don't know. This might be a little heavy. Um, maybe, I don't know. I may switch it up because I am constantly refilling that thing. So maybe this one will be a better option. I do love the color of it though, even if I just use it as a display piece. I don't know, we'll see. I love it. I love it, I love it. Okay, then I found this. I do not need any more of these. My sister just text or just let me know that she also just purchased me one of these. So Nicole North Garden, if you're watching, if you want this, it's for you. Um, it is a, it was $6.99 by the way, so I got 25% off. The large size of the Faults Graph Heritage canisters. It's in really good condition, although it, do, ooh, it does need cleaning because there's hardened sugar and all kinds of garbage in there. <laughs> I'll clean it up for you, Nicole. <laughs> and of course, there's tape residue from the tape. It was all taped up and stuff. So, um, yeah. So I will, uh, I couldn't leave it there. These things, I love them so much. And I know Nicole was at one point in time looking for them. I'm not sure if she is now. If not, I will absolutely keep it and put it to good use in my pantry. So th there's that. Uh, but I do know that my sister has another one coming for me too and I already have two full sets. So <laughs> how many of them do I need? Um, all of them apparently. Uh, so then I found this gorgeous basket. I love it so much. It was $2.99, so $2.25. And it looks like this and it's one of those cool it's a nice size you guys super nice size um a hanging basket i'm gonna hang it on a peg like so and it would be just so cute i love it a lot um love that honey color 2.99 and then last but not least i can't believe i finally found one in black i'm so excited it was 4.99 so was that 3.75 maybe, um, and it is this guy. Ta-da! I love it. I can't wait to display this somehow, somewhere. Um, it is in really good shape. There is very little rust on it. I want to figure out how to open it because I don't know. I need to figure that out somehow because I need to be able to get to the, oh, there we go to the wick, right? They have to be able to be, oh, maybe not. I don't know, maybe I'm just spinning a dead wheel. I'm gonna have to figure it out and figure out how to open it because I want to clean up the glass and wipe it all down and oil it so it's nice and shiny and pretty. And then I want to fill this up with like memorabilia or you know seasonal items, that kind of thing um, for each season. And I think this will look so cute hanging off one of the hooks in my entryway. I think it will be adorable. So that, my friends, 
is my thrift haul this week. Um, my thrift with me and haul. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for spending your time with me this week. If you did enjoy it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll check you later. Bye guys.